What's up everybody? We are Deanna and Phil and this is gonna be American Girlfriend tries more German candy and snacks. Are you hungry? Yes, of course. <laughs> gonna eat. I didn't even know that there were more German snacks and candy to try, but apparently from all the comments and Phil told me that there were so many more different types to try. I mean, I love snacks and candy. I think there's almost an infinite amount to try. <laughs> we did the first part last year. We split it up into two parts and we're back this year. <laughs> I'm ready. We're gonna do the same thing. I'll just have a huge bag here. And you're just gonna blindly reach into it. Okay. And we're gonna start. All right. Ooh. 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 Good stuff. Maxi King. It kind of looks like the Milchschnitter. Exactly. So this is Kinder Maxi King. It is a little bit like the Mil Milchschnitter. Milchschnitter. I didn't really like that. Out of the fridge. So it's a cooled candy and yeah. it's one of my favorites. We purposely chose the Milchschnitter last year because it's like the old school one. The new ones are kind of better. We'll see what better? you think. Oh, oops. I forgot. Germans always have a way of opening something. <laughs> It's not that hard. They're just <laughs> lines. It's kind of like the the knoppers problem. While you rip it, yeah. you kind of squish it. This one looks way better. Oh 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 oh! Wait wait. Oh, she found see? it. Ta da! Hi. Oh, this looks nice. Looks like, like a, a chocolate turd. Yeah, or like a <laughs> bar soap. <I> mean. <laughs> yeah. Oh, with like the the exfoliants on it. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go so try. Mm. Holy smokes, there's caramel in it. I like this one way better. I really do. I like the caramel inside of it. That is good. Wow. Wow. <laughs> oh my goodness. So I like this. The caramel is really, really good inside of it. <laughs> I did try the Milchnitter again. Milchnitter. <laughs> and I really didn't really like it. So, oh. but this is the ish. Mm. What would you rank that? This one's a 10. That's, That's so 10? good. Yeah, I love caramel. Starting out with a 10, we got the 10 video over. 9.9. <laughs> I want to know who likes these more than Milchnitter. Am I the only one that likes this better and doesn't like Milchnitter? So I really like that stuff too. It's very well known, I think. I think that's like an in-between between Milchnitter and this one, which is called Kinder Pingui, which we don't have. It's like with oh. a penguin, which doesn't have the nutty parts, no caramel. But I think my favorite is the Kinder Pingui. No, if it doesn't have caramel and it doesn't have the nuts, I don't think it would be as good. Yeah. All, right. <laughs> All right, next one. Okay, okay, okay. Yogurte. Yogurette. Yogurette. I think this one kind of lost a bit of fame lately, but when I grew up, that one was the He also told me he loves strawberry stuff as a kid, so yeah. that could be why. As a tab. Fancy one. Oh. There you go. Look at that. I think, yeah. Oh, that's it. <laughs> that's yeah. anti-climax. It was always some kind of, a little bit of a special chocolate because it's single-handedly packed, different than the Milka or the Ritter Sport. Oh. And it's like this yogurt stuff, but strawberry yogurt filling. It looks like the casing of the Kinder Chocolate because it came out it's all true, in the pack yeah. too. Yeah. Curious what okay. you think about that. These look cute. I love pink. It looks like the Duplo bark. Oh yeah, a little bit. <laughs> I don't like it. I'm sorry. I really don't. I really don't like sh fake strawberry taste. Shame on you. <laughs> mm -mm. That's not my thing. I would like it as a kid, but I really don't like it now. That's unfortunate. It was a very nice relationship <laughs> with you. No. <laughs> I see a little bit what you're saying. I get your point a little bit. I loved this as a kid. This was pr probably my favorite chocolate growing up. At some point, I, I didn't like the strawberry yogurt thing anymore, yeah. but I like the regular yogurt better now. And yeah, it has a bit of an artificial it's an taste. Artificial to it. strawberry taste. Do you want it? Well, we can give it to some kids on the street. Mm -hmm. You know the stories when I tell you if a car stops next to you and the person is like, and you want a piece of chocolate? I always picture these, like the small ones that are single-handedly packed because they're like creepier. Really? You want a piece of chocolate? Should I be concerned that you've thought about this down to the detail of the chocolate? No. Oh. Yeah, a little disappointed by okay. the yogurt. Oh, yogurt? Oops. Forgetting it. <laughs> what is it? Ah. <laughs> That's a reason why there are only three. The reason you will find out later. Okay. You don't see the name right now, <laughs> which is a little unfortunate. I think Germans know already what I did with the other three. They are the ones with ha having the name on it, and these ones don't. Yeah, it has banana, erdbeer, and apricots. Yeah, banana, erdbeer, and apricose. Apricose. Fruchtzwerge. Fruchtzwerge? Fruchtzwerge. What are you saying to me? <laughs> Fruchtzwerge. It's the name of it. Ah, okay. 
<laughs> it means fruit dwarfs. It's oh. a fruity yogurt dessert, basically. Which one do you want to try? Got the spoons here. I'm gonna try all three of them. Oh, and you really? can tell me which one is your favorite. Okay, here we go. Looks like animals. Wow, strawberry. Looks like yogurt, lactose. It's gonna be great. <laughs> lactose intolerant. <laughs> textures, textures whipped yogurt. Cool whip. Oh. I'm not a fan of the banana. It tastes super fake to me. Strawberry and apricot, I could get through. Yeah? Yeah. See, another kid's favorite. I still love them though. They're still awesome. And for me, the banana is the best. Uh, now or as a kid or both? Both. We have something similar. It's like Danimals or Gogurt. We had Gogurts. It's like this, but in a pouch, like in a stick that you suck. We kind of have something similar. Those are okay. You want to finish that one too? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna be sick. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're also used for building stuff for kids. You wash them and you have it, what do you call that? In like these glasses where you toothpicks and stuff, you can build figurines out of it. You just build stuff with cups. Yes, whatever. You build stuff with these cups. Kids do that a lot. Good reason to eat more of them. We know what Phil's doing later. Justify. <laughs> These look like warheads. Center shock. Center shock. Sour mix. Yes, I'm excited. Oh, there's a little bottom opening. That's nice. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dude, is it? What is it with with you or Americans and opening stuff? I don't think you can say all Americans. Okay. They have cute little spiders. We have center shocks. It's sour chewing gum with a filling. Rolling <clears> cherry, <throat> green apple, Mr. Sl Slimer, yeah. Crazy King. Funky monkey. Greedy spider. Here's what we're gonna do. Listen to me. I saw a comment somebody in the last video is like, where are the center shocks? There's a center shock challenge, apparently. I don't know. You take four of them and put them in your mouth simultaneously and you try not to let your face change. Oh, we did it's this sour. as a kid too really? with warheads. Warhead. I wonder if they're gonna taste similar to a warhead. Okay. Whoa, they don't look like warheads wow. though. They're this? I did not expect that. I thought they were gonna be round. Also, you don't swallow them, it's chewing gum. It's gum? Yeah. Oh. I, th I think so. I'm not even sure. Shame on me. Suck. Okay. Stack of a pie. Four of them. We're gonna look into the camera, scent a chew them, and try not to make a sour face. And okay. then let us know who makes a sour face first. Or worse. <laughs> okay. okay. One, two, three. <laughs> Got me. Holy smokes, as soon as you bite into one. Mmm. So weird. My jaw gets tired. It's definitely gum. It's gum. Mm. It's better now. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's nothing like a warhead. It's pretty sour, but then it turns into this weird gum texture. I don't like that. Yeah, it's just regular chewing gum with a sour kick in front. To be honest, uh, it's not as bad as I remembered. Yeah, they're not super sour. They're pretty sour though, especially with four in your mouth. Yeah, the sour part is kind of the fun. Cool. It's just gum then. Yeah, yeah. Them, so. Also anymore. kind of like a relict out of older times, like post-war, the Americans brought the chewing gum to Germany. Everybody wanted chewing gum. Really? It's like, why? Yeah. I think especially in the GDR, they didn't have chewing gum. And then Western Germany, they had it before the the wall fell oh. and I was in demand. People were like, I don't want chewing him. Next, Next. one! Next! We have to All right. This looks like you're giving me some type of tobacco dip. Pulmol. 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 And I see a little thing. I was surprised they still have it. For me, I associate this with visiting the pharmacy. As a kid going to the pharmacy with my grandmother, they always had pulmol there. Ooh, it looks disgusting. Why would you give this to me? They smell gross too. Hey, right, take one. Mm. Tastes like medicine. Yeah, it's supposed to be good like a, for your throat. Yeah, I was about to say a cough drop. You just gave me a cough drop. <laughs> That's but not candy. <laughs> menthol and uh, honey, just a lot of sugar. Ooh, 73% percent sugar in one and people sold that at pharmacies. Yeah, it tastes like medicine. <laughs> that was not good. I don't like that. Sugar drop. Okay, next. Ooh, bueno. Ooh, bueno. Kinder bueno. German and Spanish. Ah, ah, ah. Oops. 
Almost caught it. All right, there's a little thing. Are you going to open it right? Here we go. Wow, my wow. broken. So beautiful. Oh, it's broken. Ooh, bit. that's pretty. Look at that. You got dark chocolate little strippers on it. Are you supposed to share these? Is that why they're in little section? No, it's just for bites. <laughs> not for sharing, please. Mmm, that was good. It's a wafer with hazelnut cream inside and chocolate on the outside. It's really good. Good, but this is my stuff. Kinder just gets it right with the uh, products. Mm hmm, mm hmm. These might be in the US. I don't know. They're really good. I feel like you could just finish a box on like the drive home from the grocery store. I can eat that. I eat that in five minutes. No, as soon no as, problem. As soon as you open this box, it's game over. These are gone. Yeah. <laughs> These are like nine out of 10, 10 out of 10, maybe. Good stuff. Children, cater to the children. <laughs> More tender. Yeah. Oh, these are so cute. Happy hippo. Kaka. <laughs> Cacao. Isn't that happy hippo? Yeah. It's very similar, but maybe we can do a direct comparison to the when. Yeah. Or how do I open this? There's no special thing. I'm sure there must be. Open it. Do the American thing. So oh, they're so cute. Look at the little hippo. I don't even know. Look at how cute they are. Tommy yeah. the dreamer. Susie sunshine. Susie sunshine. Uri rasant. Fast and Furious for Rudy. Flipping Peter, I don't Aww. know. What's it, Peter? I do not know if I ever had those. Dude. What? What? What's happening? <laughs> I can't get mine out. Mine's still stuck in the box. Ah, um, mine is... <gasps> yeah, they're making a mess. Wait, it's a hippo! Yeah. Oh my god, they're so cute! <laughs> oh, look how cute they are! <gasps> I don't think so I cute. ever had that. I would have remembered that. What are you buying? The hat or the butt? The head first. The schnauz. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm. We're just gonna mm the wow. rest of it. These just got knocked down a peg. I'm sorry. These are like an eight. This is a nine. Ten. There's like Nutella inside of it. Look at the boxing. It shows you right here. It's just cream filled. <clears throat> the texture on the outside is so good. Mm. It's a very dark, very intense chocolate cream in there. Yeah, like so Nutella it's like almost. Super chocolatey. Mm -hmm. I love that. Wow, they're, they're good. good. They're so good. I like them. My first time happy hippo, I guess. Yeah, mine. Next one. Oh, I got to look at this one. <laughs> what is it? It's a stick. What does it say? Giotto. Sounds Italian. Cafe solo con giotto. I don't speak Italian, but I think that's what the commercial says. This one looks like a Ferrero Rocher. 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 Look at that. Bam, baby. Oh, these are nice. Look at this long stick. Is it a chocolate bar? Do I open it normally? No. There's a red string. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, öffnen. Oh, I see the string. I see the string. This always happens. Why? I get it. They're little balls. This is like for Rocher. 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 Mare. I probably should have looked up how to pronounce that. Oh, we just have balls all over the table. Oh, the balls. Sprinkled my hair with nuts. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, they're good. They taste like small Ferrero Rocher. That all worse. Mm, worse though. There's not not as big, so there's not as many layers in them. But I still like them a lot. It's more chocolatey. These are more nutty. Yeah, that's true. That's true. These are nutty, nuttier. Nuttier. Yeah, I guess it depends on my mood. I really like those. They're really good. Like an eight out of ten. I still think the Kinder Hippos are the best that we've had so far. Oh no, wait, the first things. Well, Kinder Maxi Kid. The Maxi. Ah, yeah. yeah. Those. We have a lot to They're go. neck and neck right now. Oh, Dickmans! Super Dickmans. Uh, yeah, here's the thing. We had chocolate kisses before in the other video, the cheap brand. So we're not gonna just eat one again. We're gonna have... Ah, that's what the bread is for. We gotta have a bread roll with one on it. Yeah, you gave that story before. Cut one here. Mm. The super dick man. Oh, whoa, they're all in the fancy things too. Oh, oh, what, what? I thought you were supposed to do that. Oh my God. <laughs> Just lift it or take one out. <laughs> There's your dick man. <laughs> Here's the bread roll. You put it on there. Deckel drauf und... Oh. There you go. Look at that goodness. <laughs> that looks like a gourmet sandwich if I've ever seen one. There you go. Let me know. Wow. Mmm. Are you gonna eat that? No. I think the bread is too uh, uh, savory for it. 
It's freaking awesome. Really? I feel like I had as a kid fluffer nutter, like uh, fluff sandwiches, like fluff with peanut butter. And that's what it reminds me of. But I don't like it on a bread roll. I like it on that cheap, flat American bread. I like these by themselves. But the point was that on there, it's not that well known. So here's the thing, this bread roll is kind of hearty, that's true. I still think it's awesome, but the, the light fluffy ones from the bakery, the round ones, might be the best for this. If you never heard about it, you're probably not thinking about putting a dick man on a bread roll. Next! Mmm, Choco Crucies. 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 Choco Crucies. Choco Crucies. Oh yeah. Get better. This looks oh, like some type of nice. cereal that you should put like a oatmeal bag. Have they always looked this nice? Did they look different beforehand? Oh, there's a little bit of option. It says peel here. I failed! <laughs> no, the little line to peel is not there anymore. I done messed it up. There we go. Alright. They look like cornflakes with chocolate on them. Exactly. You taste the salt with the chocolate to give it like that savory and sweet flavor. Mm hmm. I haven't had those in a while. These are good. Yeah, I haven't had them in a while, and I don't know why because they're pretty awesome. For I feel like I'm more excited than you trying these. These are really good. I would love these for a car ride, right? You're in a car ride, you want some like sweet and salty, and this satisfies you. Mess your both. fingers up, you grab your steering wheel, and. I love eating and then during road trips. All the it's the best thing ever. Next. Knickknacks. 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 Mm -hmm. What? How do you rip that open with a bag of nuts? What if you rip it all the way through? It's... I don't... I'm gonna try them. You want a knickknack? Yeah, sure. How do you want? Give a dog a bone? I didn't know it was gonna be spicy. Mmm. There's a peanut inside. A sugar-coated peanuts with like a spicy Cheeto flavor. <laughs> yeah. Oh. It's peanuts. Yeah, that's happened. Who you opened it. this? It's a peanut with a... Crispy shell. Oh, these Isn't are nice. It doesn't say like the double crunch or something like this that. This is a movie fe theater food. Yeah, the double crunch peanut right mm. there. Nick that. Great for our storing now. I did a great job. Well, I normally eat all of them at one setting, so it doesn't matter Go how in. I open things. That's totally contrast. a movie snack. Absolutely. Yeah. Super tasty. Yeah, I really like them. I don't know what I would rate them. A B plus. Keep going. Here we go. The back is getting a little lighter. And we're definitely getting heavier. <laughs> That's true. Are these German? Werther's mm. original? They are very common in Germany. They're in the US too. Werther's original Sahne bonbons. Sahne bonbons. Means creamy candy snack. Bonbon. 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 Yeah, these are definitely snacks that go in like a principal's office or like a grandmother would have this in a bowl. You have snacks in a principal's office? Yeah, sometimes. Yeah, little Christine. Have a Werther's original, but you're also gonna repeat seventh grade. It's like a caramelly thing. These are super popular. And as a kid, I didn't like these, but as an adult, I like them a lot. So you have them? Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. I really like them. Those are not my jam. It's hot, it's for sucking, but it's a caramel flavor. I feel like if I talk and I chew this at the same time, I might choke to death. Yeah, Stay that's dangerous. a thing, definitely. You, <laughs> you uh, inhale by accident. Mm -hmm. We'll just see you in 20 minutes. Alright, keep going. Next! Oh, how is this so warm? I'm so full. Whoa, soft cake orange. We haven't tried anything orange yet. Uh, for these things, I am not sure if this is the original brand or if there is an original brand. I just remembered those when I saw them. They were everywhere a while ago and have a very distinct flavor. I'm curious also, do you have something like that? Do you see what it is? I don't know, maybe. Just try. I I'm, feel like we might, but I thought I... the US might have it. I also feel this is like a snack from different times. I feel like the new snacks are like the Kinder Maxi King, stuff yeah. like that. This like, is not as cool. This is, small, again, something sweet. your parents would have yeah. when you were growing up. You want? Thank you. Ooh, it's a soft cookie. It's soft cookie with chocolate. Mmm. Oh, we totally have something like this that I had as a kid. I don't know what it's called, though. You like it? Not really. Me neither. <laughs> I didn't want to say it too early, but I don't like them. <laughs> it's like a, a cake with this fake orangey mm. 
taste and then thin thin chocolate on it i feel like this is catered to the 90s uh, maybe the 80s and 90s yeah uh it's healthy it's like fruit <laughs> in a snack form yeah it's bread it's barely chocolate yeah it's bread but i barely go candy shopping anymore but for this video i got all this stuff and i found so <laughs> many things that i almost forgot about like these and i was like oh there was a big thing they were everywhere so i need yeah. to try those and i wonder if people still buy that or why is it still on the shelf you got one left really two, two. Oh. Okay, let's stick. Let's go with this one first. You just took my candy. So <laughs> we're not going back and forth okay. too much. Okay, this is Fritz. 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 Another thing that I have totally forgotten about, and I just saw it in the shelf, and I was like, yes, Frit, we should get it. We should get it. Let's get a Frit. Yes. Do you want a Frit? Open it. But oh, that was a good run. Open it. You want a piece of Frit? Thanks, Mike. That's fair dinkum old school right here. Also like 90s stuff. What is it? Oh no, is it gum? I don't like gum. Why more gum? This is typical Frit. I just got thrown back into the past. There's always paper sticking onto it. Yeah, it's horrible. I'm pale on paper. It's like it was folded. You've been alive in the 90s. It. <laughs> Looks like a lick of tongue. What? Hello, man. Did you play that Pokemon 64 game with no. the lick of tongue? Blah, blah, blah. Oh. Pokemon Stadium. We got raspberry flavor. Uh oh. It's edible. I don't want to eat it. <laughs> hmm? Hmm. You spit the fridge. It's What's like wrong with it? <laughs> Dr. Dude, Seuss is a run for his money. It's awesome. I feel like I haven't had to spit anything out really except that one of edible candy. One to ten? I don't know. That's I really don't like it. I think raspberry is not the best flavor. It's not as good as I remembered. I would just rate this a four or five. I feel like also as a kid I really liked these types of candies. Fruit roll-ups, airheads, fruit, fruit by the foot. <laughs> the, the artificial flavor. It was pretty artificial. Yeah, 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 it was artificial. I don't like that anymore. Last one. Balisto. 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 Corn cereal. It's insinuating another healthier snack. Do you want to split one because I'm getting full? Sure. Comes in these little packaging. There's nine of them. Nine of them in here. Okay. It's a chocolate bar. It's a cereal. Co corn oh, yes. cereal. Corn it's cereal bar. Healthy. Yeah, when they advertise cereal as healthy. That's the 90s organic homegrown superfood granola bar. <laughs> What's wrong with you today? It tastes like it wants to be healthy. <laughs> Yeah, it tastes like field. Yeah. <laughs> it tastes like field. It tastes like field with a little <laughs> chocolate around it. I'm a bit disappointed. I got the original though. They have different flavors. That's not my favorite. We're giving that away. All right. At least still Meh. Mediocre. I didn't like it. Mittelmäßig. Yeah. All right. That was all from our back. But bonus round. We got dessert. I told you earlier the Fruchtzwerge. So ah, I did. the Fruchtzwerge. These things. So you put spoons in them and you froze it, I'm guessing. I, I froze them. So the thing is with these, uh, a lot of kids used to freeze them and eat them like an ice cream. And you just put a spoon in there. Or nowadays they even come with a little spoon you can put in there. But yeah, let's go for the dessert Fruchtzwerge. Okay, well then you can have the banana. I get the banana. I don't again. like that one. How do I get it out? You spin it? What do I do? You just gotta warm it a little bit to defrost the outer part. Yeah. yeah. And then you push it from underneath. And it comes out very easily. Oh. Like this. We did the same thing as kids. Except you would just freeze a go-gurt. go, -gurt. go -gurt. Yeah, and you freeze those. I think it's the same company. What do you think compared to the warm fluid version? Mm. This one tastes more watery. Yeah. Strangely, yes. So you would take the normal ones over Yeah, I think I would do the normal ones, but I really don't like them in general. I yeah. really still like them, and I think as ice cream, they're good too. Hot summer day, sure, why not? And last item, special dessert for you. Calicopola. Col <laughs> Calipo cola. Calipo cola. Look at this nice. Ice cream popsicle. Calipo cola. Wow. Tastes like a Coke slushy. I think I never had a slushy in my life. Really? Yeah. There are every gas station in the US. Yeah, I like it. It's nice. That you like? I feel like that was a super artificial Well, it taste is. In it's my... more nostalgia. Like, I like it because of the nostalgia for me. But I don't really like soda in general. It's like a frozen Coke. Yeah, I kind of picked this to be like this iconic weird thing that kids eat because it's Coke and kids sometimes eat this before they get regular Coke. It's not as bad as I remember. <laughs> it's not as bad. I feel like I'm getting brain freeze from watching you. 
That was it with all the items for now. I think we had a little funny selection this time. Some strong ones, some not so strong ones. What is your verdict? What's your favorite like? Hands down, these and the hippos. Where are those hippos? Kinder Maxi King and hippo. And hippos. I really like these. Also the little cereal, these things. Choco crossies. I really like those too. Uh, yeah, for me too, all the Kinder stuff just kills it. Whenever you combine chocolate with this milk cream stuff and add something like nuts or caramel, it's always very good. Uh, we have some Kinder products, but not nearly as many as in Germany. It's crazy how many Kinder products there are. Let us know in the comments below what you think. Watch our other two videos about it. Last year we made a part one and two. I think with all three of these we covered a big amount of candies. If you have more suggestions, just write it in the comments. What else could we try? What else should Diana try? If you like this video, Give thumbs us a thumbs, thumbs up. up. Subscribe to your channel if you haven't already. As always, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. We're gonna eat all of this now. Bye. Bye.